in the last video we talked about sodium chloride and sodium hydroxide the preparation of sodium hydroxide chloralkali process and the important uses of the products found in this video we are going to talk about bleaching powder how it is prepared what are the important uses of bleaching powder bleaching powder we all know what is bleaching powder it is commonly used in our surrounding areas for cleaning water do you know what is the chemical name of it chemical name of bleaching powder is calcium hypochlorite and the chemical formula is caocl2 it is prepared by the reaction of chlorine on dry slaked lime that is calcium hydroxide when treated with chlorine we will get calcium hypochlorite or bleaching powder it is used for bleaching wood pulp in paper industry and for bleaching washed clothes in laundries it is used for disinfecting drinking water to make it free from germs it is also used as an oxidizing agent in many chemical industries so we can conclude that the chemical formula of bleaching powder is caocl2 and the chemical name is calcium hypochlorite it is prepared when treating calcium hydroxide dry slaked lime with chlorine now we can move to the next one it is baking soda it is also a commonly used one in our house we are using this while making breakfast cake bread items etc the chemical name of baking soda is sodium bicarbonate or sodium hydrogen carbonate the chemical formula is nahco3 nahco3 and it is prepared by treating sodium chloride with carbon dioxide water and ammonia sodium chloride nacl when treated with carbon dioxide water and ammonia we will get ammonium chloride nh4cl along with nhco3 or baking soda it is a mild corrosive base we studied nhco3 as a base it is a mild corrosive base it is when it is heated during cooking it will liberate carbon dioxide gas which cause the bread or cake to rise making them very soft and fluffy this is the reason why we are adding it in our food items when it is getting heated it will liberate carbon dioxide gas the equation can be written in this form nhco3 on heating it will form na2co3 plus carbon dioxide plus h2o it is the reason why we are able to see some small small holes in breakfast which is prepared by adding uh, baking soda that holes are formed when this carbon dioxide gas is escaping now uses 
it is used for making baking powder it is also a commonly used one while making cakes baking powder is prepared from baking soda by treating it with an edible acid like tartaric acid baking powder is a mixture of baking soda and a mild edible acid like tartaric acid when baking powder is heated or mixed in water it will also liberate carbon dioxide gas that is the reason why it can make our food item soft and fluffy this baking soda is a ingredient in antacid it will neutralize the excess of acid in stomach and provide us relief it is also used in soda acid fire extinguisher 